In other news tonight, AI technology is giving some local medical students an advantage. Action 12's Gretchen Bolander shows us an ultrasound system at KCU that goes far beyond pregnancy scans. It's a lot of the heart and the abdomen um, and the lungs. And we're just looking for maybe any traumas or bleeding. Organs and conditions Chance Benedict is seeing in a very different way. Pocus, it's point of care ultrasound. It's basically ultrasound that you're able to do at the bedside with the patient. It's a new elective at KCU Joplin this semester. We've had point of care ultrasound in medicine for a long time, but it's been fairly cumbersome to get it to the bedside. And so as technology's improved, we now have handheld devices that uh, are highly portable. KCU Joplin isn't the only medical school with POCUS training, but the program here is unique and gives their students a leg up. Point of care ultrasound, there's nobody that's teaching it like we are. Uh, Butterfly, uh, which uh, they build the probes that we use here, uh, they have extensive AI, so literally the students can teach themselves. Students like Patrick Risco say the training is tough, but extremely helpful. We use it pretty much every single day uh, on my emergency medicine rotations, um, whether it's for a trauma patient who is potentially having some abdominal distress, or if a patient's a hard stick, um, getting an IV line in them makes it a lot simpler. It's just become almost like a, a second stethoscope for me. So if I have a, a head scratcher or something I'm trying to sort out, I just grab my ultrasound and take a look. And this specialized training can give KCU students an edge when it comes to applying for residencies with experience in POCUS training that most of their competition hasn't yet tackled. Reporting in Joplin, I'm Gretchen Bolander, Action 12 News.